Hi Filmora creators, welcome to Tube Media Tutorials. Before we start today's tutorial, let me introduce Filmora Creator Hub, where you will find all the tutorials needed to learn video editing using the Wondershare Filmora 13. Numerous creators spend days and nights to make these demonstrations, so that creators like you can easily grasp the plethora of features and tools in the software. There are different activities that take place here, participate and win exciting prizes as well. The first professional tool we will talk about is Color Match. These three clips have different color tones, maybe due to different lighting, different camera or different color settings. To use them in a montage, we might want to match the color theme, so right-click the clip you want to change the color of, go to Smart Edit Tool, Color Match. In the reference panel, seek the whole timeline clips and select the frame you want to use as the reference. For the current frame, that is, the target video clip. Click Match. And there as you can notice, the color tone is now matched with the reference frame. Let us use this frame as the reference. And now the target clip has the matching color theme. The value can be adjusted as preferred. Now, the target clip has been changed to this, a man talking on the phone. Match the color. There is this feature called Protect Skin Tone, which gives you the ability to control how much you want to retain the original skin tone of the person, which includes the face, as well as any body part that it is showing, the hands in this clip. It is such a useful feature in the Filmora 13, we must say. Applying slow motion effect makes videos look great. Let's take this dance video as example. Now, the problem is, since the video is not shot at a higher frame rate, and we forcefully made it slower, there is visible frame drop, and the video is not smooth at all. Which spoils the whole point of having a smooth slow MO video. Double click, visit the speed menu, AI frame interpolation, select optical flow. This will add frames in between, to make the video smooth and lag-free, using artificial intelligence. This might take time, and some processing power, but the end result is stunning. So, if you don't have a high frame rate camera, or forgot to shoot at higher FPS, making slow motion videos is not an issue anymore in the Wondershare Filmora 13 editor. For any run and gun video shooter, camera shake can ruin the videos. For vloggers, wedding videographers, event or sports shooters, stabilizing the footage and post-production is a must. In the Filmora 13 video menu, we have this AI tool, Stabilization, which works like magic. There are three smooth levels. This is what normal level looks like. The violent shakes are gone, we get a normal handheld footage which is much more pleasant and acceptable. If you go for stronger stabilization, you get a gimbal-like super smooth footage, suitable for a lot of scenarios, where there is too much shake. Let's compare it to the original clip. You see how shaky the video was? So guys, these are the three must-know professional tools in the Filmora 13 video editor. Every creator should know. To download and try Filmora 13, click the link in the video description. Thank for watching Tube Media Tutorials.